The right camping cooking system can contribute to great times. But the wrong tools can lead to catastrophe. There's no question that camp cooking can be a great delight or an excessive disappointment. The pleasure comes from serving tasty, I did it myself vittles. There's the anticipation as the meals cooking, and the smells arise in the clear air of the campsite. The catastrophe can take many forms, uncooked and cold grub, burnt meat, food with ashes or gas contaminating it, or a mixture of any of those elements. So how can the proper cooking equipment make a difference? Well, first of all, some equipment and cooking techniques are more suitable for a novice camper than others. For instance, a lot of people have grilled in the backyard. Some have even used a charcoal grill. If that's the case, you may need to acquire a portable charcoal grill, or perhaps a propane grill stove combo. That is probably the best way to get well-grilled food while you use the burner beside the grill to heat a bowl of soup. There's another fundamental factor, how long are your journeys to be, and the way you're taking them. If you are car camping and using public campgrounds, you can discover grills already available so that you might not have to carry your own. And if you're going to be backpacking, both time span and difficulty will help dictate the equipment that is functional and useful. If you're car camping, each of the equipment, including range, utensils, and cooler, may be larger and heavier than your backpacking tools. Also, the sort of food and condiments are dictated by means of the type of camp you'll set up. There are transportable one-burner stoves that can boil water in minutes which might be actually designed for wilderness backpacking. With them, you can carry dehydrated meals you just pop into the boiling water. And for car camping, you would possibly choose a Dutch oven wherein you could set a complete stew or chili over the fire to cook dinner and simmer for hours. Then there may be equipment quality and price. Like most everything, the high-priced equipment generally equates to higher quality. But that does not mean there aren't good quality gears being sold at discounted prices, especially in the off-season. So, in short, right here are some issues while evaluating equipment. How experienced are you at camp cooking? What kind of camping will you be doing most regularly? Will your equipment need to be backpacked in? What is your equipment budget? How frequently will you use your camp cooking equipment? These are some of the issues that need to be taken into consideration. Camp cooking may be as tricky or easy as you want it to be. If you want to put together quick and easy but nutritious meals even as you're camping, camp cooking does not even require a fire. But if you are inquisitive about fueling your camping trip with a feast, camp cooking can assist you to make hot, healthy meals that are as good as you can make them at home in your own kitchen. Camp cooking does now not have to be constrained to sandwiches and baked potatoes wrapped in aluminum foil. Almost any cooking approach you use in the kitchen can be duplicated around the campfire. For example, use a Dutch oven or pit cooking to bake your food. You can also easily fry foods in a pan over a grill, or boil, braise and roast. What kind of camping cookware is suitable for you? The following are a few camping items to take with you in case you are planning on preparing a few meals across the campfire. These are common kitchen equipment that will let you replicate tasty meals while you are outside. Salt and pepper, and spices cooking oil potholder handheld can opener aluminum foil tongs and spatula cutting knives cutting board mixing bowl paper or plastic silverware, plates, and cups. If you've just a few campers and are seeking out a few easy camp cooking, attempt the easy and quick approach of tin can cooking. Your source of heat may be a small campfire, or if wood burning is illegitimate, a small buddy burner will work well, which can be found at sporting goods shops or online. Place your meal inside the tin can and simply heat the contents of your can over a flame. You can have a hot meal prepared in minutes. This approach works extremely well for soups, beans, and tuna fish. 